All right, tonight's challenge. Max on board. Another big challenge. Max's challenge, actually, this time. I suspect this one will come back to bite him. He wanted some Blair's Ultra Death. Only the hottest sauce in my entire collection. So Ultra Death is, uh, they say, around 800,000 Scoville, something like that. Pretty close to a million. Just shy of a million. So tonight, Max's challenge. Oh, let's break the dish. It's going to be to have a flaming Hot Cheeto that's going to be uh, dipped in my teaspoon of Blair's Ultra Death, which I suspect... Whoa! Jeez. Well, it got to be like that. It's been shot. Yeah, it filled the cap. That's nice. And the neck jam made a souffle on the top of the bottle. That's a spicy neck jam. Okay, it's a so spicy meatball. Spicy meatball. You got it, boy. This one is going to leave a mark. Okay, so. Damn, look at that. Cap is full of sauce. The scary thing to me at this point is the bottle of sauce that I thought would have was going to last me forever has come down to about here in the jar, which is unthinkable. I can't imagine how I managed to eat that much of this insane, Daddy. insanely hot extract sauce. It's an extract sauce. You're so looking very, right at them. Very forgiving. No, you haven't been eating this sauce. Not like that. Not in quantities like that. Mm. I mean, I've had some. Yeah, little toothpick, little match head size spoons. This is going to separate the men from the boys tonight. This will be the biggest quantity. Oh, God. God help me. The biggest quantity of an extract. Oh, jeez. Oh. oh, my God. <sighs> That's going to be the biggest quantity right. of an extract sauce that I've ever had. Let's see if we can get that up there. That's almost a good, well, it's a good teaspoon anyway. Not a heaping teaspoon, but it's a, a pretty good teaspoon <laughs> of extract. Blair's Ultra Death. Okay, so hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Keep it in frame here. Okay. Don't be, uh, oh, come on, little <laughs> wimpy. Are you kidding? I'm going to do a teaspoon. Okay, that's better. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, you know what? This oh, one's going to leave a mark. This is going to leave a mark. This one's going to leave a mark. Okay, so what's the name of the channel? Synchronized Fire, Fire in the hole. hole. Hmm. Believe it or not, there's actually some texture in there. <coughs> I got some seeds. Got <sighs> on the back of my throat right away. That's a lot of heat. That's a lot of heat. Right. Pumpernickel. Oh, my goodness, that's a burn. Oh, man, it's all down the back of my throat. Oh, I'm breaking out in a sweat. What do you think? That's hot. That's hot. Is it hotter than you thought it was going to be? Oh, uh, no. You thought it was going to be that hot? No, it's going to be hotter. Yeah, well, step up to the teaspoon. Oh, hell no. I'm sweating. My eyelids are sweating. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to wash this shirt after. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh. Oh my goodness. That's going to bring an endorphin rush, actually. Oh, my gums are all wiggling. Oh my goodness. It's an endorphin That's rush. the hottest thing. So, uh, your body, your brain thinks that your mouth is on fire, actually, literally on fire. And your body produces a natural painkiller called endorphins. And it produces a bunch of it because it thinks, oh my god, his face is on fire. Put it out. So, it dumps this endorphin rush, which is a I also call it a runner's high. Sometimes when you're running, you can get a, a uh, your brain will dump a, a load of, uh, of uh, feel good uh, stuff. The back of my throat. <clears throat> Mine too. At least finally it's letting go of the back of my throat, but I can feel it everywhere in my mouth. It's all over my tongue. It's all over the roof of my mouth, back of my throat. That is hot. And I suspect this is only going to make it worse. Under my tongue, wow. Oof. Oh my goodness. That was a hell of a challenge, boy. Cheers. Oh my. Oh geez. I swallowed it and made it worse. Yeah.
that's what the apple juice is doing too. Oh man, I almost flipped over my friggin' glass. That would have been bad. Oh. And you go refill. All right, well, let's sign off then. I'm not staying on for all that time. Wait, give me a second over. I'm not. All right, well. That was ridiculously hot. What did you fill with water? Yeah. Oh, gray water. Oh, that's okay. Uh, ice milk water. Ice water milk. Yeah. That's oh, my it. stars. That is really, really hot. At least you're getting through it. Oh, it's not letting go either. It's just staying there. Yeah. At least it's not my dog. Yeah, well, the numbers mean something. The Mad Dog Silver, that would be painful. I don't think I'd do a teaspoon of that Mad Dog Silver. And my dog. Oh. Hey, Sal. All right. Oh, my nose is running. My back of my neck is actually sweaty. Oh. I didn't cry, though. That's something. Takes a fresh pot almost to make me cry. At least I didn't cry. That's true. You always have that little choke thing at the beginning, though. It <coughs> always gets you like that at the beginning. Well, we're coming up on the seven minute mark, so. Wait, that's six minutes right there? 6.45. So, what do we say at the end? Say goodnight, Dick. Good night, Dick. <laughs>